Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Welcome back once again to the channel where we provide odds with value. As you can see, I'm very, very happy today. Today is a wonderful day. Today is a special day. Today is a great day for me. Obviously, it's my birthday and I'm very, very happy. And I thank God Almighty for giving me another opportunity to see another birthday. To be honest, it's amazing. It's wonderful. I'm very, very happy. And I really appreciate you guys for the messages, for the love, for the support. Every single thing I'm seeing a very big thank you so thank you guys i saw a lot of messages from the comment section direct messages on instagram on i don't do facebook on um twitter a lot of messages even on telegram thank you guys so much i really really appreciate each and every one of you and i pray that this um this birthday of mine brings us some um, happiness brings us some um, success brings us every good thing we are looking for and i pray on myself that all my heart desires shall be granted by god's grace and i also pray that all our heart desires that we have been searching for for years for months the lord god almighty is going to help us and bring them to pass amen so that is by the way happy birthday to me once again for those asking me how old am i now yes i am dash 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 years old so that is by the way let's dive into the business of today so before i talk about our today's games let's briefly talk about our previous result anybody down to take me out for my birthday you can send me a dm anywhere you are any country you are i'll come and meet you be it portugal ghana togo afghanistan anywhere you are pakistan india turkey i will come and meet you and celebrate the birthday just send me a dm jb i want to take you out for your birthday i will come to wherever you are canada us i will come <laughs> i will come over there so let's talk about our previous results yesterday i shared two slips and um our sleep one was 50 plus odds and our sleep two was 25 odds and to be honest i won't lie the games did well yesterday and um, the sleep one, we had 15 games. Out of the 15 games, 13 games were successful. Our sleep two, we had 15 games also. And out of the 15 games, 13 games also were successful. So let's briefly talk about the games very, very fast. So regarding the goals markets, as I've said before, 50 odds. I shared 15 games. We had Man City to score over 1.5 goals. It was successful. Luton to score over one goal. It was successful. Wolves versus West Ham over 1.5 goals. It was successful. We had Bayer Leverkusen to score also. It was successful. We had um, Hayden Hem versus Bayern Munich. We saw how Bayern Munich lost 3-2 um, yesterday despite leading 2-0. So our predictions were over 2.5 goals. It was successful. We had Coventry versus Leeds over 1.5 goals. It was successful. Middlesbrough to score over one goal. It was successful. They scored two goals. We had um, Bruton Albion versus Oxford. We had um, over 1.5 goals. It was successful. Le Wagner versus Moss. Over 1.5 goals. It was successful. Dufamil Athletic versus Patrick Tis. Two, over 1.5 goals. It was successful. Reading versus Lincoln City. Over 1.5 goals. It was successful. Mansfield Town. Crowley Town. Over 1.5 goals. It was successful. And Sporting Club de Portugal versus Benfica. Both teams to score it was successful if you can remember yesterday i told you sporting i gave you a correct score yesterday if you were listening to my uh if you listened to me very closely yesterday i dropped a correct score you understand i dropped the correct score yesterday so for those that are listening very closely you will know that i dropped the correct score because i said it sporting versus benfica i told you that the game is going to end in sporting winning 2-1 and i gave you my reason for it and yesterday, Sporting won 2 1. For those that managed to get it, congratulations because the correct score was amazing. So we had um, 13 games winning, and the two games that was lost was um, Everton versus Burnley over 1.5 goals, in which Everton won 1 0. 
and Norwich versus Ipswich, both teams to score, in which Norwich also won just 1 0. So, out of the 50 odds, we had 13 games winning and two games lost. So, if you listen to my advice, like I said yesterday, editing the games, I even dropped an edited version. Like, I gave you the one I staked on, like the edited version. I made three odds out of the 50 odds and I posted it on Telegram and it was successful. So, if you won from these 50 odds, like editing the games, picking three games per sleep or four games per sleep, congratulations. So that is for our goals market. Then the corners market that we also recorded the same similar result, 15 games and out of the 15 games, we had 13 games successful and um, two games lost. So let's just briefly talk about it very, very fast. Give me one second, it's loading up. So we had the first game to be Everton versus Burnley over 7.5 corners, it was successful. Brighton Arsenal over 7.5 corners, successful. PSG versus Clermont Foot over 7.5 corners. They did 19 corners in total. Amazing. It was successful. We had Roma versus Lazio over 6.5 corners. It was successful. Bayer Leverkusen, we had Bayer Leverkusen to have over 4.5 corners and a general over 7.5 corners. Bayer Leverkusen had 10 corners. Union Berlin had 7. So it was successful. We had Norwich versus Ipswich over 7.5. Successful. Likewise, Middlesbrough, uh, Coventry, Bristol, Bristol Rovers, Wolverhampton Wanderers, Fulham, Luton Town. We had all of them over 7.5 and 8.5. It was successful. The only two games that messed up our corners was um, the AC Milan versus Lecce and Blackburn versus Southampton. They both had around five to six corners. So, but we had 13 corners winning and two losing. To be honest, the games did very well yesterday. And if you listen to my advice, to be honest, you should be in a position to make profit. And I did my best by also sharing you an edited version on Telegram. And it was successful. So guys, that was for yesterday. Let's dive into today's business very fast. And as you watch the video, ensure you are hitting the like button and subscribe if you have not subscribed. So today we have on our goals market, we have um, 10 games, 18 odds. Then the corners market, we have... Um, the corners market, we have seven games, seven odds. I repeat, the goals market, we have 10 games, 18 odds. Corners market, seven games, seven odds. So let's dive into the games. So the first game on our list is a game between Manchester United and Liverpool. And before I call my prediction, I would like uh, to know what you think about this game. Who do you think is going to come out with the three points? Is it Liverpool or is it Manchester United. Remember, Arsenal and Man City won their game yesterday, giving Liverpool the bigger edge in this match today because Liverpool wants to win the league, Arsenal wants to win the league, Man City wants to win the league. So you should know that Liverpool is going to come out in this game with full force. But you know that Manchester United are always giving Liverpool kind of uh, a very serious and heavy tough time. And I believe Manchester United should be able to score at least one goal in this game. But definitely Liverpool should be the better side in this match. They might end up winning this game either 2-1 or 3-1. But who do you think is going to come out as the winner of this match? So my prediction for this game is both teams to score at 1.50 odd. Manchester United versus Liverpool, both teams to score at 1.50 odd. We have another interesting game between Sheffield United and Chelsea. Chelsea that did an amazing job against Manchester United on Thursday, I guess. Yes, I believe this particular game, Chelsea should be able to come out as the winner because funny enough, yesterday, Chelsea did not play any match. They saw themselves in ninth position. First time this season, Chelsea left 12. Imagine almost all the whole season, my club has been in 10, 11, 12, 10, 11, 12, 12, 12, 12. For almost the whole season, now we did not play any game. Yesterday, we saw ourselves in ninth position. Is the Lord not wonderful? So Chelsea really needs this game. You understand? Chelsea really, really needs this game. And I believe they should be in a position of winning this match. And my correct score maybe might be Chelsea 2, Sheffield 1. Or Chelsea 0. Or Chelsea 2, sorry. Sheffield 0. But I believe Chelsea should win this game with a good number of goals. And Cole Palmer scoring also. So, Chelsea to score over 1.5 goals at 1.50 odds is my prediction. Sheffield United versus Chelsea. Chelsea to score over 1.5 goals at 1.50 odds is the prediction. We have Tottenham Hotspur versus Nottingham Forest. We have Tottenham to score over 1.5 goals at 1.40 odds. 
We have from the Scotland uh, Premiership, we have Rangers versus Celtic. We have both teams to score at 1.61 odd. We have Wolfsburg versus Borussia Mönchengladbach. We have um, Wolfsburg to score over one goal at 1.25 odd. We have from the France League one, we have Toulouse versus Strasbourg. We have over 1.5 goals at 1.25 odd. From the Belgium Pro League, we have Royal Union St. Julius versus Circle Bruges. We have Royal Union St. Julius to score over one goal at 1.20 odd. We have um, Club Bruge versus Anderlecht. We have the total goals to be over 1.5 goals at 1.22 odd. We have Sparta Prague versus Malda Boleslav. We have Sparta Prague to score over 1.5 goals at 1.50 odd. And finally, SK Ban versus Fedriskad from the Norway Elite Terrain. We have SK Ban to score over 1.5 goals at 1.40 odd. So guys, these are all the games for today. 10 games, 18 odds. I repeat, my United and Liverpool both teams to score. Chelsea to score over 1.5 goals. Tottenham to score over 1.5 goals. Rangers versus Celtic, both teams to score. Wolfsburg to score over one goal. Toulouse versus Strasbourg over 1.5 goals. Sparta Prague to score over 1.5 goals. And um, finally, SK Bound to score over 1.5 goals. And Royal Union St. Julius to score over one goal. So guys, these are the games for the goals market. 10 games, 18 odds. Remember, edit these games to your satisfaction. And I might also drop an edited version on Telegram. So make sure you are joining our telegram so guys that is for the um goals market let's dive into the corners market we have seven games seven odds the first game on our list is a game between man united versus liverpool my prediction is over 9.5 corners at 1.50 odd we are expecting 10 corners in this game but remember you can reduce the corner to 8.5 or 7.5 so man united versus liverpool over 9.5 corners at 1.50 odd Sheffield United versus Chelsea over 8.5 corners at 1.40 odd. Cagliari Calcio versus Atlanta over 7.5 corners at 1.25 odd. We have Juventus versus Fiorentina over 7.5 corners at 1.40 odd. We have Toulouse versus Strasbourg over 7.5 corners at 1.40 odd. We have um, Monaco versus State Rent over 7.5 corners at 1.30 odd. And finally, Hoffenheim versus Augsburg from the Germany Bundesliga over 7.5 corners at 1.25 odd. So guys, these are all the corners for today. Seven corners, seven odds. I repeat, my United game over 9.5 corners, you can reduce the corners. Sheffield versus Chelsea over 8.5 corners, you can reduce the both of them to 7.5 corners each. Cagliari Calcio Atlanta over 7.5 corners. Juventus, Toulouse, Monaco and Hoffenheim game over 7.5 corners so guys these are all the games for today i wish you the best i wish you success remember you can edit these games to your satisfaction the goals market and also the corners market i wish us all the best and i pray today that is my birthday we pray today comes with a massive success so guys i've come to the end of today's video have a blessed day don't forget to stake what you can afford to lose remember one thing this is football and anything is bound to happen a lot of things affect a prediction, but I pray today success will be ours. Don't forget to join our Telegram and don't forget to like the video, share and subscribe. I will see you tomorrow. Have a blessed day. Have a wonderful day and happy birthday to me once again. Bye for now.